this is Darren here. Today's story is Captain Pepper's Pets, um, written by Sally Grindley. Chapter 1. Captain Pepper wanted a pet, but he didn't want a parrot. Every pirate I've ever met has a parrot, he said. Parrots talk too much. No, I want a pet that will make me famous all over the world. So let's go to the pet shop, said Pirate Nong. Goldfish are best, said Pirate Noodle. Let's buy a hamster, said Pirate Noggywog. Duck Twix, roared Captain Pepper. A hamster or a goldfish won't make me famous. Oh, what I want is something different. What Captain Pepper wanted, Captain Pepper got. So off they sailed abroad the snooty fox to search for a pet that was different. Chapter 2 The pirates sailed for many long weeks. At last they reach an island. Aha! cried Pat Captain Pepper. I bet my boots will find my pet here. Full speed ahead, you horrible lot. They sailed down a river and into a jungle. Stop! bellowed the captain. Lower the gangplank and get ashore. Find me a pet or I'll feed you to the sharks. And Captain Pepper lay down in his hammock for a nap. Come on, sighed Pirate Nong. Let's find his pet. Then we can go home. But as the pirate stepped onto the gangplank, Noddypol slipped and fell into the water. Help! he screamed. I can't swim. Suddenly a huge toothy creature tossed Noddypol up into the air. Help! he screamed. I want my mum. Captain Pepper jumped to his feet. Bless my soul, it's a hippopotamus, he shouted. That would make a good pet. Bring it on board. The hippo didn't want to be brought on board. It snorted and stamped and snapped at the pirates. But at last they hauled it up onto the deck. Welcome aboard, my hippo pet, said Captain Pepper. With you by my side, I shall soon be famous all over the world. He patted the hippo's head. The hippo snorted and rushed across the ship. Crunch! He bit the mast in two. Crash! The mast fell onto the deck. Stop that now, the captain bellowed. Captain Pepper glared at the hippo. The hippo glared back at Captain Pepper and charged. Captain Pepper dived into the way, but the hippo kept going right over the side. Splash! That hippo was trouble, said Captain Nong. Can't we go home and buy a parrot? No, the par captain snorted and snarled. A parrot, he roared. Not on your Nelly. Find me something different or I'll feed you to the sharks.